The protests we've been showing over the last two days sparked by a movie many people call anti-Islam for mock mocking, of course, the prophet Muhammad. But the cast and crew of that film say they were grossly misled about the film's intent and purpose. In fact, one actress in this movie who asked not to be identified says the original script didn't actually include a prophet Muhammad character. She talked to our Miguel Marquez. This woman who does not want to be identified says that she is horrified by what's happened and says that she was straight out lied to by the writer producer. She responded to a generic casting call for what was billed as an action adventure film set 2,000 years ago, a low budget affair called at the time Desert Warrior. You find yourself in the middle of a sort of an international nightmare. That's what I find myself in the middle of, of a world that I've prayed for. For God to help. Killing is never right. In her portion of the script, the Prophet Muhammad character was called George, who was referred to during filming as either Master George or Father Master, never Muhammad. She was paid $500 for a few days' work, but she says the writer producer, Sam Basil, lied about the film's content. I think it's very unfair, and I'm very sorry for his fa that man, his family, and everybody else that was hurt. She even phoned Basil, whom she says remains defiant. He said, tell the media that I'm tired of the Muslims killing innocent people. Steve Klein consulted on the film. The motivation was to spark some change within Islam. Only of these few fraction, you know, a fraction of the fraction of these very dangerous men, if we could somehow open up the eyes. The actress doesn't want her name used because her family is fearful, but she isn't. What's your overriding emotion right now? Is it fear? Is it anger? Anger and hurt. I'm not afraid. My husband is afraid for me, but I'm not. I'm pretty pissed.